Well, boxing fans over here with one of the faces, ring announcer, David Diamante. David Diamante, thanks for allowing me, you know, to speak with you. How you feel? I feel great. Thank you, man. I appreciate hey. it. I feel great. We're in Brooklyn. We're my hometown, so I'm, I'm super happy. I bet you that you, you feel happy to be home, sweet home. You know, everyone on TV sees you, like, traveling, UK, um, all these places that, you know, eventually you have a lot of good experience. How does it feel now in order to... You cover boxing, you are, you know, the, the voice of, you know, every event. How does it feel like, you know, to be I'm in different places? I'm absolutely honored. It's, uh, it's one of those things where I'm constantly pinching myself to see if it's real. I'm living my dream. I really am. It's what I love to do, and I hope that shows to the fans because uh, I don't take this lightly. I take it super serious. Yeah. Um, boxing is a very serious sport. I know we all have fun, and that's great, but at the end of the day, this is a very serious sport. These guys are hurting each other. It's the hurt business. So I, I understand that and I respect these fighters so much. And I think it's very important that we all respect the fighters. And the least that someone could do is get their name right in the ring. So, and there's more than that. It's about learning about the fighters, their history and, and, and the backgrounds of them and stuff like that. So uh, I love what I do. I'm very passionate about what I do. And I think boxing's in a great place. So. Uh, rock and roll, baby. Yes, definitely. Yeah. I say, yeah. you know, you said it, you know, way, you know, correctly. And all this, you know, experience that you will have um, in in your career one day, you know, when I guess we see your retirement, it's gonna be great <laughs> for history. Long, hopefully, but a long we don't want to. But we don't want to <laughs> see you. We, we want to continue and and see, you know, all these great fights. And talking about great fights now, women's boxing, and I don't know if I should call it women's boxing, but you know these athletes now they're gonna they're gonna bring an excitement fight how do you feel now serrano heather hardy they used to spar in each other and now look it's amazing it's one of those things it's funny i've known both of them for a very long time i've announced a lot of fights for both of them I mean, heather coming up on broadway boxing and bb kings and roseland and then all of a sudden she's fighting all these fights at barclays and i'm calling all of her fights then amanda you know same thing broadway boxing her coming up, winning her world titles. I mean, I've announced fights for her out in Brooklyn at the uh, at the Aviator, and then Madison Square Garden just recently. And you know, now she's a seven division world champion. That was Ooh. a real thrill to be able to announce that fight for her because that's 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 historic. Yes, you know, it it's is. historical and um, it's history. It's just a great fight. So they're both Brooklyn women, um, and I think it's it's going to be a really exciting fight for the fans. Um, and I love that they're doing this presser for it. It's an all Brooklyn fight, and I will be announcing it. And I'm a Brooklyn guy, obviously, so you know it's all Brooklyn in the ring. And um, we'll see who the referee is. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, it, I think it's gonna be a great fight. So yep. I'm looking forward to it. I think it's great for boxing. And uh, like you said, whether you call it women's boxing or not, it's it's really hot right now, as it should be. Some great fighters out there. You know, not just Cecilia Breakhouse, but Katie Taylor and Clarissa Shields, Clarissa Shields. and all these all these other people. And Shannon Courtney's now coming up and. Diff different uh, women fighters around the world really making noise. Love it. Very happy. I love it too. You know, I can't wait to see all these, you know, great fights takes place and and see it, you know, making happening. Big thumbs to, you know, um, Eddie Hearn, um, also to Ludi Bella and sure. promoters that def definitely they want to make these fights happen. Um, right now, I feel like women's boxing is growing, you know, strongly. How do you feel about, you know? Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, it's, but at the same time, there's still, there's still quite a discrepancy uh, between the, the, the fan base and the pay and stuff like that. And you see it with, with women like both Amanda and Heather going to MMA mm -hmm. because they want to make paychecks and they're trying to, you know, support their families. And uh, boxing so far hasn't really caught up. And you see what happened with Ronda Rousey in the MMA world and, and all kinds of other women fighters that have come up there but I think you know Ronda really kind of opened the doors to make uh, really open people's eyes to, to women's combat sport like Christy Martin did back in the day for, for mm -hmm. women's boxing um, you know and of course Leila Ali and Ann Wolf and these great women fighters uh, back in the day but I think uh, it's gonna catch up and I think we're seeing that and I think this this press conference is, is a, a good showing of that yes it is yes it is I, I actually spoke with them um, the two of them, and I mentioned, I think you two, the two of you ladies, you should be the main event. I mean, not disrespecting Devin Haney, <laughs> but how do you feel like if they would be the main event, both of them? Well, listen, I think it's it's a fight that could be a main event, absolutely. I mean, I think that, uh, you know, 
Sergey Kuzmin and Michael Hunter, um, uh, Akhmadaliev and, and Danny Roman on this card. There's some great fights on this card, man. But like, you know, look, I don't, I don't, I don't make those decisions. I just announce them. Yeah. But uh, is it worthy of being a main event fight? Absolutely. But um, just in order, in order to give them honor and appreciation, because I see like women's boxing is not really like too too many support, you know, on this movement. But I think that's you know, I'm I'm speaking in order like. We'll see if it is promoters or whoever you know is on the top. Make it one day happen, like main event. Like, oh, I think we'll see it. I think like we'll the, see it one day. I, the I don't, the I don't way we saw not. Clarissa Shields and and Christina Hammer. Sure, that was a good fight. Oh, it really was. I uh, I absolutely believe that we will see that at some point, um, and you know probably in the not not too far future. But what I love about it is all these fights could be main events, and that's that's to me it's about you know about putting it together a card. That's not, uh, you know, what they call Cowboys and Indians card. You know, just people with upside down records on one side of the ledger. It's it's a great, it's great matchups, great night of fights from top to bottom. And that's also one of those things with boxing, man. You know, to to, to go to Forrest Gump. You know, boxing's like a box of chocolates. Sometimes you never know what you're going to get with a fight. And everyone loves to say styles make fights, and it's true. Styles do make fights, but at the same time. You can have two guys with great styles, it looks great on paper, and it's a dud. Or you can have two guys that maybe doesn't look so great, and it's a barn burner. You never know. It's like you go into that box of chocolates, and you're not sure if you're going to get the mm-hmm. caramel or if you're going to get that <laughs> cherry cordial. You know, you don't know what you're you going to get until you have get. it. So any of these could be a, a main event fight, and I just want to see good fights. I don't. To me, I'm not about. I don't. It doesn't matter to me as long as as long as they're on the card. Personally, I don't care who's the top bill or not. It's not about that for me. It's about watching the fights. Watching so great events. Yeah, I can't wait to see. I think it's a great scrap, and, and we'll see.